Okay, we desperately need to talk about how cool this jacket is. Um, I wore this for the entire trip and believe it is the single best Scotty vest we have ever, ever made, bar none. It's so versatile and um, in so many ways and so much thought has gone through literally every single position of every single pocket and every single, single zipper and internal pocket and magnetic placement to make this the single best jacket slash vest you have ever owned as a utility garment, not necessarily to be thought of as any degree of serious warmth um, per se, but with water repellent fabric that is also breathable, magnetic sleeve remover, removes removal pockets this pocket in particular is designed so you can slide your phone in there and not zip it up and without worrying about it falling out and then there's a pocket within here that if you want that added layer of security and to put your phone in there grab it out quickly the position the angle the weight of the fabric the fabric to ch choose to selected for each one of the pockets was selected with so much specificity and thought and pocket science, if you will, um, that it makes your life easier. However, what I discovered is that you have to be religious about putting the same things in the same pockets every single time. Um, for a lot of people, that's really hard. It's truly difficult. Um, and even for me, but you have to be religious about it because if you don't, honestly, it's just gonna make your organizational thought worse, process worse. So in my case, it, it, once you decide where you're gonna put it, put it there forever. It's like once you start sorting your email in a certain fashion, you don't change the next day and the next day and the next day. You say emails are sorted in this fashion. I'm gonna sort my files in this fashion, sort your desk in that fashion. And you think of your jacket as that manner, it's gonna help you immensely in your, your adventure of life. Um, for example, when I wore this, you know, not only is the versatile, the magnet cape and everything else, I keep my phone here, but in these pockets here, I can quickly look down and notice that this zipper is in a locked position. That's where I keep my wallet, my passport, and all my uh, significant travel documents. It has an RFID pocket in there. I, I honestly didn't use that terribly much, but the icons here are really helpful so you can see where to put things. And this pocket you can look at quickly, but you can see it's not locked. The, the top one, that's where I keep my poop bags. And I keep a ton of poop bags and dog related stuff in that pocket. Now each of them are you know, labeled to use for suggested purposes, but don't necessarily feel bound by those labels. Use wh whatever pocket suits your purposes best. In this pocket, I would keep my eye drops and a little toothbrush and toothpaste. I could kind of call it my toiletry pocket. And the pocket beneath there I would keep extra battery and cords. So on this one garment, and I haven't even utilized all the, oh, eyeglass cleaner as well. I consider one pocket kind of toiletry kind of stuff, one top pocket for the dogs, one pocket for my wallet and passport, always being, feeling secure because we have a pickpocket guarantee in the event that you are pickpocketed. Um, it, it, it fun, it, lightweight and, and warm. I actually wore it when I was um, sleeping on the, on the plane. It felt so comfortable to do that. You just need the magnets. You have to line up carefully. And once you do, they stay in place. You can hear them click just now. Um, and it's just got enough water repellency to it. If you get caught in a little rainstorm, you're gonna be fine. And it has a hood that's removable as well. And another back pocket where it packs into itself. This is a product that is underrepresented on our website. And if you look at all my videos from my recent trip, I'm wearing this product in you know, 50 degree weather, in 80 degree weather, on the plane, anywhere I went. And um, I highly recommend it. It's called the Scotty Vest Tropiformer 3D. Bye bye.